Hey guys, hi, this is Amy L. Um, welcome to Healthier with Amy L, where I try to have us as a team come up with ideas to make the journey to be healthier um, and fitter a little bit easier for all of us. I want to apologize because, look, I have a sty. I'm sorry. Um, my friend Lisa told me that I should get a ring light. So I have one um, and and it's great, except for you can really see that that's puffy. Um, hopefully by Saturday it will be gone. Um, and so listen, today I want to do something new. I want to kind of recap what's been happening in workshops over the last week. I'm going to try this out, see if you guys like it. And if so, then I'll do more of them. Um, but so last week was really good. Um, it was about changing our mindset when it comes to tracking. Sometimes tracking our food can seem like a chore. Um, so I have a little example that um, might resonate with you. Um, okay, so uh, I went to get a facial and it was lovely and it's something I don't do often. <laughs> Um, but I, I did it and it was great. And during the facial, the esthetician was saying, um, asking me about my skincare routine. And the truth is I don't have a skincare routine. Um, it's not that I don't have the tools. I have all kinds of, um, creams and lotions and, um, serums and all kinds of stuff. I just, I just don't do it. Um, and I was explaining that to her and she said that she used to, before she had kids, feel so sorry for people who couldn't spend the time on themselves. And that's, I honestly, I had this like moment where I realized that for her, washing her face, um, putting the serums and moisturizers on is a form of self-care. And to me, it's a chore. Um, and because of that, I'm guessing she washes her face like twice a day. Um, and for me, it's this thing I have to do. Whereas if it was a form of self-care, something that I got to do and wasn't I lucky that I got to do it, I'd probably do it more. So the reason I'm sharing that story is not to confess all of my uh, bad habits, but to think about tracking in the same way. I know that for me myself, when I am really doing well, when I'm doing great at tracking, it feels like investigation. It feels like uh, I'm just getting the information. It doesn't feel like punishment or that I'm doing something wrong. It feels like, oh, I get to find out how many points things are. I get to see where I want to make changes. Um, when I'm not doing well is when it feels like, oh, I've got to do this before I get to the end of the day. Um, so there's nothing wrong with fake it till you make it, that it's okay if, if you need to have boundaries on the tracking to make it happen. But I want us to think about really shifting our mindset and having tracking be a tool that we use to get information about how many points things are or where we're spending our points or why our weight's not where we want it to be. The tracking is the way we find that out, and it's something we get to do. Um, WW has given us the information so that we can figure it out, and from there we can make changes. So I hope that this is helpful. Just a quick little tip on how to change our mindset. Um, like I said, if you'd like to have these kind of recaps of what's been going on or maybe great things I've heard, just let me know in the comments, and I'm happy to do more of them. Um, and... I think that's it. So I will see you hopefully soon if you're nearby. It's never a bad time to start over. Um, and if today is that day for you, think of it as self-care. Thanks. Bye.